Hello everybody and welcome back to yet another Hearthstone deck experiment. Um, today we are going to play an Undertaker Paladin. Um, if you haven't seen an Undertaker Paladin before and how it works, is you just want to get at least one Immortal Prelate um, death to go off. And then you want a bunch of other death rattles that you want your Undertaker to have. Because the pr Prelate will allow the Undertaker to keep its um, death rattles. And then put itself into the deck while keeping those death rattles. So, basically what this deck uses is only two creatures battle uh, death rattles, the Mortal Prelate and the Tunnel Blaster. Now Tunnel Blaster, when it dies, it deals three to the board. So what we want to happen is continually playing more and more Undertakers um, with Lifesteal and Taunt. We have Sun Fury Protector and uh, Light Forge Blessing to help just increase the uh, output this deck does. And we have one Baleful Banker in here to play immediately against decks like Mage that can uh, polymorph our Undertaker, if they know what we're doing. Is the deck good? It's fun. There are, uh, it's up and, it's ups and downs. Uh, Now this isn't a full control list. We are splashing in the last Kaleidosaur because this deck does run quite a few target things and we don't really have any good one turn one play. Good turn one plays, so figured it fit pretty well. Uh do I watch a coin here? Is it counter spell? No, it's not. Okay. Draw. Not that. So we're against Secret Mage. Now that's a pretty aggressive deck, so hopefully this deck can control it a little bit. Well, this should this should uh, play out pretty nicely here. Okay. Not quite sure what his secrets are. They didn't. That one might be now a counter spell than the new one he played. That's a good draw. This should help us go into the late game a little bit easier. Okay, that died right away. That's actually good. We have at least one of those death rattles gone off. Does he have another secret? No. Well. I don't think they get to keep the echo. If I want to try. Figured it might work like that. That's okay. The fact that he's attacking my minions is a good thing. Not as aggressive as he wants to be. Heal my face. Draw a card. Good. Undertaker. Her power pass.
Hmm. Maybe another counter spell. Definitely another counter spell. Only five damage here. Kind of wanted him to play another minion. Hmm. Do I think he has polymorph? Or is one of those... Explosive rune. If it's explosive rune, the thing dies immediately. And keeps the prelate's death rattle that it'll gain. Fortunately, we haven't had tunnel blaster die. If it's potion of polymorph, I... I'm in a bad position, but... Even Baleful Banker can't save me from that. Yeah. I think I'll take it. There it is. Okay, now he's starting to go a little bit more aggressive. Hasn't played another minion yet. Well, that's good. Oh, good. Okay, so he did run it. I just got a little lucky. Ow. Okay, now I'm going to bait out Counterspell. Ooh, no Counterspell. Okay. This only removes two damage, but oh well. Getting pretty low on life. Oh, am I dead? Oh, oh well. Guess he just got us. Fast games means more games, I guess. Hopefully we'll get to show off the Undertaker value. appreciate some of the names of the people you play against. Like uh, Poop Baby here. They just don't get better than that. Hmm, odd Paladin. Wild Pyromancer is going to be very, very helpful. Now I'm hoping he attacks his, uh, Divine Shield into that. If he hero powers and clears with the Divine Shield, I can Pyro coin Solemn Vigil. Because five things will have died. Although if he goes face, I guess five things will have died too. Okay. This isn't so bad. Ok, 
Okay, well, I can mind control this. Uh, one of the two on the left. Eh, oh well. Hopefully he plays a pump onto this so I can Aldor it. Oh my goodness. Okay, maybe I want to save. Or maybe I just Aldor this now. I think that's the best play I got. Next turn, if something survives, I'll probably just Bells it three times. Moves the quest a little bit further. Or at all. Would definitely be nice to have another Solemn Vigil. Maybe between this game and the next one, I'll switch out the Kaleidosaur package for a draw engine. The deck wouldn't change too much. Because the board as he has it right now isn't terribly scary. I think a 6-8 is definitely scarier than what he's got. He's barely got 6 power on the board too. Drawing a Pyromancer would be the best option for me. That's not a Pyromancer. Shrink Ray actually does nothing. All, it, all Shrink Ray does is remove one, two, three, a total attack on the board. No, not even. It's, it's only two. Getting pretty close. Wow, okay. Um If I shrink ray everything and kill one thing it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Fired one more mana. I could heal for a bunch, but maybe I'll just take the damage without the lifesteal. Kind of, I guess, just have to. I don't even know if this saves me, really. Could have another Iron Beak Owl and just silence it, but looks like he doesn't. Whew. 
Whew, I'm very close. Oh, okay. Wow. Give him the fireworks. Do I even have something? No, it's just hello. Okay. Well, let's try it with the draw engine. We just seem to be going against too much aggro. Which is every fun dex weakness is aggro. Okay, let's take out the uh, Kaleidosaur package. Um... So what I want is that oh, I pass the Christology and then oh, Acolyte of Pains. That's about as card dry as I can get. Yeah, let's try that. I was just thinking, um, I saw Augmented Elec there for a brief moment. Technically, every time Da Undertaker shuffles itself back into the deck, Elec, if it was on the board, would put two into the deck instead. And the same thing with the Prelates. I doubt they would keep their enchantments, the, the copies, but... Maybe I'll try that later. Hopefully this more card dry version of the deck gets us there, because <laughs> I can already draw two cards, turn one. Christology's really good. And uh who knows, maybe he's big priest. Card draw that car draws into card draw. Play prelate, and then acolyte, and then that. Now we never want more than two of these to um, death rattles to go off before uh, we play to Undertaker, because if three are in the pool, there's a chance he could just get three over and over and over, and you could never get the tunnel blaster. So just gotta be careful with that. Maybe we'll save this for turn eight with the steed. If he's got Shadowward Pain, I don't usually see big priests running that. So we could be in for a fun, fun, fun match. Just one more card I could put in here is Sunkeeper Terum. Not sure what I would take out for it. Hmm, he's back. Probably won't be playing that. He might be Copy Priest. If he is Copy Priest, this game highly depends on whether or not his Undertaker keeps its death rattles. Now, hopefully, he doesn't just Shadow Word Horror us, because we would like to draw some cards off of these Acolytes. That's not bad. That could get guaranteed both Righteous Protectors out. Oh, it's he's some sort of hybrid Inner Fire Priest? Well, let's get the Protectors for sure. The 
this keeps our acolytes alive and lets us draw a bunch of cards. Ten cards in hand as well. He hasn't really done too much. Okay. I think I'm still fine with that. Another protector. I think we very much still want to kill this. I don't want it overrunning us. Interesting. I think I have to attack and just play a card. Oh, that's definitely card draw. Can make it free. What do I play here? I think I'm just going to play another prelate. Hope he doesn't kill it. Yeah, I don't think I can even cast that. I would burn a card. Undertaker's in our hand, that's nice. Hopefully Spiker steed the prelate. Even if he silences and removes all of our prelates now. Okay, well he does have a tunnel blaster. Let's get the Spikered Steed on here. This is going to go bye-bye anyway. I think I want to get the damage in. Just in case he silences it, I chipped in three damage. Makes it easier for him to just pick clean this, but I still have a two six taunt behind that. Okay, yeah. That's perfectly fine. It didn't die, it's just a one three for him. It's better him taking that than our Undertaker. Okay. I have the option to kill everything with Pyro Shrink Ray, which would draw, kill five things and let me play this for free. Is that worth it? He could have a scarier board. If he plays one big thing, I'll add her. So I think I want that just to dig into my deck a little bit more. Draw two. There's a Tunnel Blaster. Okay. Hopefully he doesn't steal that. That would suck. Still good for cards. I've still only had one Prelate die, so I'm just going to play this. One is all you need. Perfect. Okay. I don't have to worry about drawing them anymore either. The problem is if he takes this. I 
His deck is definitely Steel Priest, so I'm a little scared. I still have the other one if he does, and hopefully he doesn't take the last one I have. That's what I was worried about. Well, I am going to change that to one attack. I wish there was a way for me to kill my own Tunnel Blaster. I think I'm just going to Undertake her and bank her it. See what he does. I gotta assume he's still got a mind control left in his deck. Ooh, that's gonna keep that enchantment. It's weird that he... Oh, okay, he did target this. It looked like the cursor targeted that one. could just still give this taunt. Ooh. I definitely could give this taunt. I'm going to draw first. Hmm. I think this is more important. So give one of these life steal. Now he still has to try to shrink it somehow before he can play another one of these on it. Mm, that's not good. Okay, well, we managed to get the shutter, I mean, the Undertaker combo going, but played the very worst deck we could have played against. Bet you anything, this one gets stolen too. Well, there's a lot of options. Ooh, if he's attacking it. Oh, well. That sucks. I am too away from death. Play this and give it taunt. And I'm pretty sure I'm still dead. If I was able to give this life steal, that would be fine, but.
yeah, just killing that kills me. Well, I got to show off what the deck does. Unfortunately, we got thrown against two very aggressive decks, um, which stomp on fun. And the exact worst deck to play against, that was also a fun deck. So, that was just unfortunate. I guess if you guys want to see more of this deck, just let me know in the comments. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. And if you did enjoy it, please hit that like and subscribe button. And then turn on that notification bell if you haven't already. And thank you guys very much for watching.